and the family. Yeah. But they'll be stuck in some cold, gray government building with a scrawny little tree and a tinny recording of jingle bells playing in the background. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> jingle bells. <laughs> That's it. I'm the governor of this state. Maybe I can't clear up their legal problems, but I can certainly have them as guests in my house on Christmas Eve. <laughs> Call my limo. Sure, governor. I'm gonna pick up those kids personally. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna get every single one of those kids a Christmas card. <laughs> Make sure those little tykes have a Christmas they'll never forget. By golly, I love Christmas. Just when you're about fed up with Clayton, he pulls something like this. I disagree, Commissioner. I think they're very much a family. I'm disappointed in you, sir. I'm upset and I'm angry. Merry Christmas. There, that ought to fix it. Now, let's see here. Oh, you look wonderful. Oh, the children are going to be so thrilled. It was sweet of you to invite the other youngsters from the orphanage. Come in. Oh, hello, Benson. <laughs> well, Santa, I think they're about ready for you. Oh, OK. Oh, I don't have my Oh, they're upstairs. <laughs> Mary, can I speak to you for a minute? Oh, isn't this the most wonderful Christmas Eve? Yes, it is, but you know, um, Day after tomorrow, Ben and Margaret are going to have to go back to state custody. Benson, you worry too much. You don't worry at all. No, there's nothing to worry about. Everything's going to turn out for the best. Why do you refuse to understand? Nothing can be done. The law is very clear. You're going to lose those children. No, I won't. The law is not on your side. Benson, don't you believe there's something greater than the law? Yeah, 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 I believe. But right now, what I believe isn't important. As long as he knows you believe, there's nothing to worry about. So I'm going to the party. <laughs> uh, what is wrong with that woman? She thinks the answer's gonna fall right out of the sky. Why do things like this only happen when you're alone? <laughs> oh, isn't it a beautiful tree? Yeah, I wish we had something to put on the top. Hey, what happened to that shiny star we had last year? We're missing a whole box of ornaments. Ho! Ho! Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Ho! Ho! Uh-oh. Oh, there's another one. All right, hold it, kid. Now, wait a minute. I was here first. Well, that's true. Did you both bring presents? Uh, yep. Then who cares? <laughs> uh, governor, there's no governor here, just Santa Claus. And his helper. Well, Santa and his helper, can I see you for a moment? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, Mary, there's plenty of Christmas candy in my sack for all the boys and girls. Yeah, I think I found something. Clayton, read that. Uh -huh. What is it? What is it, Bunsen? It's a law which allows you, as the governor, to designate any facility you see fit as an orphanage. That's exactly what it says. Where did you find this? Well, let's just say it fell into my hands. Well, that's wonderful. How does it help us? Well, sir, as I read this law, you could designate the cook's quarters as an orphanage. Oh, right, and then put the kids in Mary's care. Very good, Santa. Mary, Mary, <clears throat> Miss Krause. Benson has brought us the best Christmas present of all. Mary and the kids can stay together. Oh. Oh. Come on, everybody. Let's sing Christmas carols. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 
Do you know joy to the world? Sure. Joy to the world, the Lord is come. Let earth receive her King. Let every heart prepare him room. And heaven and nature sing. And heaven and nature sing. God rest ye merry gentlemen, let nothing you dismay. Remember Christ our Savior was born on Christmas Day. To save us all from Satan's power and we are gone astray. Oh, tidings of comfort and joy, comfort and joy. Christmas time now. Look on top of the tree. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Benson. Merry Christmas, Mary. Christ was born. 